What is going on guys, Andrew here. Happy New Year to everyone who celebrates it. It was nice just kind of being able to just relax and just reflect as always. I always do that on the last day of the year. I just reflect on everything that happened in 2021. Today we're going to be reacting to Nikado Avocado. Well, soon in his own life, very weird title. This is from Anna Oop. This is her like main channel that has like a million subscribers. But regardless, she makes some amazing videos. So I'm excited to see what this one's gonna be about. I've never heard of this guy, so let's go ahead and jump right into it. And I hope you guys enjoy the video. I guess he's a food reviewer, I'm assuming. you guys are an OG on my channel, then you probably remember how your girl used to make tons of videos on Nikocado Avocado in the past, and how his huge scandals went viral on social media. Many of you have probably seen the many videos people have been reposting I've about Nikocado. I've never Nikocado. seen this guy in my and, life. well, things are getting worse every day. Nikocado Avocado, aka Nicholas Perry, gained major success over the years for many different reasons, but it was never for a good reason. In fact, ever since Nikocado started his YouTube channel back in 2014 and was vegan, people have always been hating on him. But as time went on, the hate just started getting worse, and during this time, Nikocado went from being the vegan king who does vegan mukbangs on his channel to this. Now, you are probably thinking, what exactly is it that makes so many people hate Nikocado? It Nikocado looks like, Avocado? not to be rude, well, but it looks like he gained really a lot of weight. say it's one thing, but the hate reached an all-time high when Nikocado in 2019 showed his true colors and was exposed by other mukbangers in a series of videos for being a creep. All he did was contradict himself, bluntly lie, and twist and manipulate stories. Say whatever you want, boo-boo. I am done. I am no longer scared of you because all you do is twist things and lie. I think it's starting to show. It now, seems like the side of YouTube that I don't really watch. going viral obviously but... boosted his career and more people started noticing him. But it also got him an image for being a hypocrite and manipulative. As time went on and with more and more people started hating on Nikocado, he went down to a very dark place and his videos just started to get worse and worse. Previously, he didn't really used to gain a lot of views on his channels, but then let's just say that something changed because it seemed like Nikocado realized that the more he ate, the the more money he could make and the more people would get interested in him. After all this, Nikocado began posting messy mukbang videos of him eating cheese takeout, this noodles, your chicken, and even burgers. What's terrifying about all of this is that Nikocado even made his boyfriend Orlin join in and do the mukbangs with him. So he basically became just like him and it didn't look good at all. Oh. So, like, I mean, they both gained based weight? on their old videos together, yeah. it seemed like they had a very cute and healthy relationship in the past. But as of now, things started to go completely downhill in their relationship. In fact, the videos they posted together got worse for each video they posted, and many started begging them to break up. From getting into sensitive arguments to physically fighting to gain some views, let's just say that things weren't looking very good and their relationship became extremely toxic. Now, as a All result for the of this, clout. both Nikocado and Orlin kept going because they both realized that the drama gained them their attention yep. and clout. Which brings us to the next point. Which is, Nikocado's constant and desperate need to fake his personality to gain views and how it keeps getting worse and worse for every new video he posts. In fact, it has now come to a point where Nikocado is literally crying on the floor and throwing food all around his boyfriend in videos. I mean... Just take a look at this. Don't touch me, fucking more. <laughs> now, many what? are wondering whether he's creating this fake persona of him acting all crazy just to go gain views and make oh, yeah. people feel sorry for him, or if he actually has a serious mental problem. Well, at this point, it seems like it's not real, since the majority of people actually believe that both Nikocado and Orlin are in fact acting, and that Orlin has become a huge contributing factor to why Nikocado continues to get all the views and money from all the controversy. Some people say this. The best thing you can give a person is an education. I'm actually very educated, guys. I know I'm this train wreck on YouTube. It's all on purpose. You know, I'm an actor, okay? I went to ask, acting school for four years. Like, mm. I, I, it's different, okay? I'm, actual, I'm actually a person strategizing what I do. I'm not actually stupid. I play the role of stupid because it sells, but 
<clears throat> Anyways, it's. I'm gonna pause it right there. This is what a lot of people actually do. Uh, they just won't admit it when it's just like, I'd rather somebody just come out and admit something than stop trying to make it seem like it's real. Because what happens is people do start to believe that it's real. And all right, play the video. Honest hour. <laughs> In case you're wondering where Nikocado Avocado is going from here, well, it seems like the money he earns is actually skyrocketing as he just bought a $2 million what? house, all from being a creep and eating himself to death on YouTube. Now, unfortunately, it seems like the money he earns is more important than his health, so mm. he won't be stopping anytime soon. Well. But the truth is, people are starting to get really worried that he's taking it too far. And many have started speaking out and posting videos to document how horrible things are starting to get. Apologize. Not on a regular. Probably imagine if Nick Akato keeps on mukbanging every day, there will definitely come a time where his health will suffer, and all of mm. the acting and getting bigger won't be worth it. Here are some of the many opinions that people have to say on the situation. I don't feel sorry for him. He knows exactly what he's doing for popularity and money, but you do you. People fail to understand that he wasn't healthy when he was a vegan as well. Like the video said, he thought he was overweight. He had an eating disorder before and still does. It just looks different. This is sad. Hmm. Honestly, don't see how people watch his content. It seems very depressing. Money can't be worth it. We have constant reminders money doesn't equate to happiness. He had an eating disorder even when he was vegan. He just needs a therapist and a balanced diet. Anyways, loves, if you need more controversial videos on influencers and celebrities, then just make sure to click on this video right here. Well, that is the end of that video. Uh, personally, you know, that just seems like he's really just clout chasing, honestly. I mean, he gets the game of the algorithm and how it works. I mean, the mukbangs obviously get views, but I've always thought about that in my head. I'm just like, y'all realize y'all do have to eat pretty much healthy every other video that you do then because... If you're gonna eat all this crazy amount of food, I hope that you're kind of leveling everything out because it's gonna catch up. Obviously, you can see that he's gained a lot of weight. I mean, did you see how skinny he was at the beginning? The man is legit big now. I mean, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below though. I hope you all did enjoy this video. I just wanna say I thank and appreciate every one of you all for coming to this channel and uh, God willing that we're gonna get to 100,000 subs. Just appreciate every one of you all for watching, commenting, and subscribing. Thank you all for watching once again, and until next time, peace out.